Good morning. This morning we read Titus chapter 1 and Paul is writing to one of the uh, young men who travels with him, who's uh, starting out in ministry. And Paul is writing to Titus who is left in Crete to encourage him to put the Cretan church in order. Um, in fact, Paul says that you might put in order what was left unfinished, appoint elders in every town. So Paul is encouraging him there to appoint leaders, local leaders, for local churches. And he gives some guidance about what an elder should be like. They should display something of the character of Christ. They should uh, be those who are living, whose words and deeds match. Uh, they hold firmly to the trustworthy message that has been taught. So they're not people who are carried away by every wind of doctrine. They can encourage others by sound doctrine. This is key in these days when there are so many winds of doctrine blowing around. So much nonsense being taught in the name of the Lord. Just like that, we need people to be raised up who are sound in doctrine. Who, have got, who, who keep the trustworthy message and are able to preach it positively and clearly. They said there's lots of problems in Crete. People uh, are trying to disrupt the gospel with uh, false doctrine. Um, make sure that the people who you appoint are able to stand up to them. And then he goes on to talk about what some of the false doctrines are. But he does say this to the pure, all things are pure. There are legalists are always looking to make outlaw things, to make things dirty and unclean. Those who know the Lord recognize God's blessings first to the pure. All things are pure.